We are leading up to the 17th Sunday after Pentecost in our Bible trivia and Bible study. We're on week 28, day four, and we've had our Old Testament reading, our Psalm, and our New Testament reading, and today our questions will come from the Gospel of Matthew. Question number one, who came to question Jesus' authority as he was teaching in the temple? A, the disciples, B, some shepherds, C, the chief priests and elders, or D, some Levites. Who came to question Jesus' authority as he was teaching in the temple? A, the disciples, B, some shepherds, C, some, the chief priests and elders, or D, some Levites. The correct answer is C, the chief priests and elders came to question Jesus' authority. Question number two, what happened when they questioned Jesus' authority? What happened? A, Jesus ignored them. B, Jesus told them he was the Messiah. C, they were thrown out of the temple. Or D, Jesus asked them a question. What happened when they questioned Jesus' authority? A, Jesus ignored them. B, Jesus told them he was the Messiah. C, they were thrown out of the temple. Or D, Jesus asked them a question. The correct answer is D. When they asked Jesus a question, Jesus turned around and asked them a question. Question number three. So Jesus asked this question. Where did John get his authority to baptize? Did he get it from heaven or earth? So when Jesus asked them a question, this was it. Where did John get his authority to baptize? Did he get it from heaven or earth? As the chief priest and the elders argued among themselves, what did they believe Jesus would say if they responded from heaven? So the chief priest and the elders were arguing among themselves. What did they believe Jesus would say back to them if they responded they believed John got his authority from heaven? A, you were correct. B, then why didn't you believe him? C, you were wrong. Or D, that is blasphemy. So when Jesus asked the question, where did John get his authority to baptize? Did he get it from heaven or earth? As they argued among themselves, what did they believe Jesus would say if their response was from heaven? A, you were correct. B, then why didn't you believe him? C, you were wrong. Or D, that is blasphemy. The correct answer is B. Uh, they believed that Jesus would look at them and say, if John got his authority from heaven, then why didn't you believe him? Question number four. Why did they believe that they could not respond from humans to the same question? You know, their choices were from heaven or earth. So why did they believe they couldn't respond from earth? A, they were afraid of the crowd because that crowd thought John was a prophet. B, they were afraid Jesus would be mad at them if that was their response. C, they didn't want to anger God. Or D, they didn't want everyone to know they were confused. So why didn't they believe that their response to that question could be from earth? A, they were afraid of the crowd who thought that John was a prophet. B, they were afraid Jesus would be mad. C, they didn't want to anger God. Or D, they didn't want everyone to know they were really confused. The correct answer is A. They were afraid of the crowd who thought John was a prophet. So they were afraid to respond that he got his authority from earth. Question number five. So the chief priests and the elders told Jesus they didn't know the answer. They didn't have a response. What was Jesus' response to them? A, Jesus refused to answer what kind of authority he had. B, Jesus left the temple. 
C, Jesus threw them out of the temple, or D, Jesus laughed at them. So when the chief priests and the elders told Jesus they didn't know the answer, what was Jesus' response? A, Jesus refused to answer what kind of authority he had. B, Jesus left the temple. C, Jesus threw them out of the temple. Or D, Jesus laughed at them. The correct answer is A, Jesus also refused to answer what kind of authority he had. Our scripture reference today is Matthew 21, verses 23 to 27. Matthew 21, 23 through 27. This is an interesting story. Uh, and I, I love Jesus' response of, you know, well, if you're not going to answer, I'm not going to answer. And tomorrow we're going to, uh, to look at, continue with our gospel lesson, actually, and look at the parable of the two sons. <laughs> 